Hi guys, and welcome back to Vintage Story with me, Kat. We are now on our series two, episode four. I hope you guys are all doing very well and are enjoying this new series that we had to restart for our Vintage Story. Um, I hope you guys did watch the first three episodes. Um, I feel like it's been really great. Our world is awesome. You can take a look. Um, our house is not all that great. Um, we, we do have a cover. We have somewhat of a decent sized house. Like I said, it is pretty empty. We got just, um, you know, the little cooking stations there, a bed, a little bit of firewood, some tool racks, a shelf. We have a door. You can see on my back, I do have a chest. I was able to use my six gears and buy a few items because I went to the trader on the last episode to possibly buy a lantern, right? Well, it looks like when I went there, I was a little too late. The trader restocked his goods and yeah, well, I didn't get the lantern, but I'm still happy guys. We have a chest. I can, you know, get extra stuff when I'm collecting resources which normally, you know, I always have a chest anyway, so I got an early game. I'm happy. We got one door, one shelf already, so I think we're sitting good. Um, monsters are going to appear here, I believe, in a day, so I can't goof around. On the last episode, right before we ended, guys, um, we went to that ruin right by the house, and guess what? Remember how we didn't do our windows yet? I did the top. I did our sailing and remember how I told you that I need to hurry because drifters are coming and that I told you I needed to do the windows ASAP, right? Because drifters will throw stones through the windows. Well, in that ruin, guys, we found a whole stack of 64 of the lead windows, right? Let's bloody go, guys. That's awesome. And guess what? We didn't do pottery yet, right? Well, if you watch the episode, we also got in one of the chests, I believe it's two of those cooking pots that we can put on the, our fire. Oh my gosh, that's so awesome. Um, but I still need to make bowls, obviously, and crocs. So we do need to start our pottery here. Um, maybe we'll do that this episode. We'll keep this episode short. Um, but yeah, like I said, monsters are coming. We can't goof around. Um, so like I said, I, if you guys did not see the first three episodes, please go back into my playlist, go under Vintage Story Season 2 of our Vintage Story series, and go watch the first three episodes, guys. This world is going to be awesome. We already have a good start. We already got Terra Preta marked. We got copper. We got tin. We got zinc. We got quartz. Um, we have a lot of great things and some translocators. So guys, please go back and watch that if you have not seen the other three episodes. And look at our storage. We have four hollows um, that are going to be dedicated to tree seeds and crop seeds. I do have quite a bit of storage. Um, can definitely use more. And behind me, we got the crates that I found at the translocators. So I think we're sitting good pretty much for inventory. I could probably use another um, few more baskets, but other than that, we're sitting good. We do have a temporary dirt home. I'll eventually upgrade this, guys. Don't worry. Um, everything takes time. We just started this world. Uh, be patient. Give me time. But anyways, guys, let's go. I hope you guys are enjoying this video, and as always, please like the video if you do enjoy my content, as it will help my channel grow. And, um, yeah, just be sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel. If you're not already subscribed, I'd really appreciate it, as well as turn on the notification bell so you know when I upload my next video or announcements. And, guys, let's go. Let's bloody go, guys. I can't goof around. Cat has to get those windows um, if you remember on the last episode, I did not grab those um, because, like I said, I had to go. Um, I had to do a live stream, so I literally had to jump off and get away from you guys, unfortunately, at that particular time. 
let's go get our goodies, guys. It's just over here, like I said, not far. Monsters are not here, and, you know, even if they were here, you know I'm not bloody scared of no nasty drifter. So, guys, um, let's show you quickly on the map. Our home is here, right? Um, I am next to a hollow. These two hollows are not going to be... Um, I'm not going to chop these down. These are here to regenerate every three to five days with more goodies of tree seeds and crop seeds. Because I do, now that we got the house um, somewhat built and, you know, secure, we are going to start our crop farm here. So this is the ruin I'm going to go to. That's where um, we have the goodies. The This is the cave I have to enter to go to Translocator 1, Translocator 2. So yeah, guys, we're sitting very good. We do have some berries that I have been, um, so these are raspberries. Let me go ahead and just clip a few more um, because what I'm doing, guys, is I clip the berries, right? And what it does is we can basically reproduce and multiply and increase our berry production, right? So if you clip them, you don't lose the ones that you clip. You're just basically producing more, right? So that's what Kat's doing. We're basically making it where I have more, more berries than it started with or whatever. So that's a smart move. If you are new to the game, I would highly suggest clipping the berries if you have um, you know, the ability to. It's not hard. All you have to do is take a knife and clip the berries and just go ahead and, you know, replant it's it's not hard but you do have to clip berries with a knife so make sure you have a knife and you're good to go so let's go guys we need to go to that ruin which is i believe right here i know it is a little dark guys i can't go to bed because like i said monsters are coming i'm gonna need some dirt as well um i'm gonna need some dirt because we use all of our packed dirt guys to do the um how you call it, to do the, the top of the house. So I'm pretty low on dirt. Can definitely use more dirt for packed dirt. Cause remember when you're in the, when you're in the caves, um, especially me, I like to use packed dirt to, um, to help me go up or go down in caves as well as block off areas that need to be blocked off that I don't want any nasties to reappear. So blocking off the area is something I always do. Everybody should be doing. See, monsters begin to appear, guys. I told you, cat can't goof around. Monsters are here now. Um, and that's why cat wants to get those lead windows, like right now, um, at, the, at the ruin. We're gonna get it right now. Okay, I don't like that floating tree because I believe that was the hollow or something. Yeah, we're going to knock these stuff down so I can get some sticks. Like I said, we do need to find, um, well, we found clay, but I mean, I need to grab, harvest some clay and start doing clay stuff because we need the crocs. I got the co cooking bowls now for free, um, but we need to have the crocs to preserve the stuff. And we're going to need, um, so the ruin is right here, guys. I'm just getting some. I'm getting sticks, guys, because we're going to need sticks for sure. We're going to need the sticks for the, um, you know, for the clay forming stuff to do the pit kill. So I'm just, oh, that's a berry bush. Don't want to break that. I thought it was a, a regular bush. I'll probably grab this, guys, just because it's wood. It's not a hollow, so I'll grab this. This is um, berries. We're going to go ahead and replant that so we don't have that on our inventory. We'll just go over here. There's nothing over here, so that's fine. Okay, so let's go get our goodies, guys, which I could not harvest. Um, so this is basically a ruin. Um, I can definitely dig up and get these materials for the home because um, there are, this is, um, oh, guys, this is limestone. So if I have a quern, guys, yeah, I'm going to grab this. I, I thought, thought that that was granite. Oh, wow, this is limestone. Guys, if I grind this down, this is our um, this is our lime. We already have 23 um, pieces of 
I didn't realize this was a limestone um, ruin. Um, we already have 23 of the, oh, and we got some bony soil, guys. Yes, let's go. Um, we, we have 23 pieces of ground up lime that we got in a ruin in that cave. So yeah, and here's some money, guys. I couldn't pick it up, like I said, last episode. Um, I really had to get off. So we got three money because we just spent our money. So here is the chest, guys, that has um, the 64 glass paint glass pane windows 32 peat and the two cooking bowl cooking pots guys that is very valuable to me very great i'm very happy very thankful for that let's go ahead and grab this bony soil we will pan this just in case we get some goodies um i believe if i unearth this ruin there might be more bony soil underneath and honestly i would love to get that as well so if i could that'd be great um, I'm not sure if I'm going to do that right this second. Um, I don't know, but I want to get these, um, you know, how do you say, building materials. I want to just take them with us. Um, we could stock it on, on the outside of the house. Um, I could definitely use it, it looks like, to make, what can I make with this? Um, if I wanted to make whatever, slabs, more stairs, or limestone dry stone what does it take for that one of those oh and you still have to have limestone stones okay well that's kind of expensive how about these one of these and what's that mortar we don't have mortar guys is that see that's why i usually don't get this stuff guys um the bricks because it's so expensive i don't know I don't, I'm not really excited about it. I might just stock it by the house just to look pretty. Um, what are these? Oh, gosh, guys. These are snowberries. We're going to break these, guys. Um, these are not valuable to us. We cannot eat those. We will die. Um, I thought they were regular berries. Um, yeah, I'm not going to pick them up. I'm not going to bloody eat them. Um, I, I, could, I could eat them, but I know that my health will go down. So we don't want those guys. We don't want those. I'm going to pick these up just because I want these out of the way, guys. Um, because, like I said, I want to get this ruined because there are some stuff I do want. I want the stairs um, and I do want the bricks. I just don't want to make more because apparently I have to have mortar and I don't have mortar. So that's not going to happen. But I'm more interested in what's underneath here. Basically more treasure, more bony soil. Um, that's what I'm excited for. So it looks like our inventory is full. Um, even though it said monsters are um, appearing now, um, but they're like not really here at this second. Um, and they're not gonna, I mean, I'm not scared of them. I can definitely kill them. I'm not worried about them per se. I'm just getting what I can get. Are these, yeah, this is not actual bushes. But yeah, I want to put these windows in, guys. It's going to look so fantastic. Even though we have a ghetto dirt, dirt house, at least we have nice windows, right? <laughs> but that's okay, guys. Like I said, we're just starting. So we can't expect much, right, guys? Um, you know, you can't expect me to have a nice, you know, house right away. Um, cause like I told you guys, number one, we just started, but also I don't have access to a million ruins. So you can't expect me to have all this, um, cobble, you know what I mean? So I, I just, I don't have that kind of material stuff guys. Um, so I can't have the most fanciest house. I, I'm sorry, not at this second, especially with just starting. Um, but I will try to get this house beautiful as much as I can obviously I guess we can do the windows from the outside guys so I don't have to go inside and do it let's just go ahead and do it from the outside see how that looks oh I want it from the inside it, there's a gap uh, I guess it doesn't matter right guys I mean I just need windows so. let's go guys let's go cat has bloody windows look at that let's go um, I will have to put dirt here, guys. I didn't notice right here. Um, it's not nighttime now. I can take off the toilet. Oh, you guys can't see. 
My bad. Um, see how the dirt, d there's not much dirt right there? Um, I don't want to fall. Like, I need a little bit more, how you call it? Like, more space when you're um, walking around the house. I didn't notice that. Um, so I want to make it a little bit more, more space, I guess, is what I'm saying. There we go. I don't want to fall off edges or whatever. So, ah, oh, let's, that's kind of nice, guys. We got windows. Um, we can't complain. Um, that's actually really nice. Um, most people, obviously, most people in the game just starting off, trust me, are not going to have lead, leaded, um, windows. So, Honestly, I have an advantage. Um, that's great. And we have 48 more pieces. So I could definitely um, increase the windows if I wanted, guys. I could do another layer. But um, I want to have space for, because we're not making our house any taller, um, this is enough just for us. Um, you know, for the meantime, I will, if I upgrade the house, then maybe we'll, we'll see about that. But for now, it looks fine. I'm gonna take back my ladders. I didn't do that before. But guys, this is starting to look kinda nice. Kinda liking it. Kinda feeling it. Okay, let's put some stuff away. We will put this here, right? Um, and let's go put our cooking pots where they belong. They will go here, guys. Cooking here and here. This one will be for the crucible. Um, wait, we have wood. Let's put the wood away. Um, we have some bricks. Um, I don't want them in the house, like I said, because honestly, I'm probably not going to use them. And it's just going to like, basically, um, you know, like, because I'm not going to use them, like, if it's in my house, just taking up space, that's kind of pointless so we're just gonna put it here for looks guys um because we know like i said cat's not gonna use them for right now um we definitely don't have mortar like i said so i just want to stock it here guys get it out of the way keep it out of the house basically um so that's fine i'm gonna get some of this grass guys i will need this for um when we do our clay forming i will need it to do the pit kill here shortly and it's taking off the grass away from the house which I like um, too much grass I don't like it you guys know that okay so that knife broke that's fine I'm just collecting these resources because guess what I know I'm going to use it not only are we cleaning up our area and tidying it up we are going to be really using this for the pit kiln because I will have to get our basic necessity stuff out of the way. Crock pots. Um, we, we need bowls. We want to, you know, get that um, started. We already got the, luckily, we already have the cooking pots. We just need bowls and crocks. And other, like stuff, like one crucible, that kind of stuff, guys. Even though we're not worried about the smelting process right now, um, I always just do a crucible in the beginning. Um, Usually I do a crucible with the um, the two cooking pots because you have to fill a, you know, a pit kiln slot with four things. So I usually do one crucible and then like two um, cooking pots and maybe like a bowl or a crock. So just to make it, you know, fill it up the space or whatever. Okay, how much? Okay, so we got a stack and a half of grass, that's okay. Okay, so now we know monsters are appearing now, so basically at the nighttime tonight, we're definitely gonna have monsters. So we have a decent amount of grass. We're gonna need some sticks here. We're gonna go ahead and put our peat down, because the peat, um, we don't, yeah, we don't, I don't think we're gonna need this now. It is starting to be daytime. Give me one second, guys. I need to do something really quick. Gotta text my mom back. Hold on, guys.
she's not here right now, and I'm watching her dog. So we have grass, we have that. Um, now we need to, we put the, we put the, um, the firewood there. Let's go ahead and put the peat here. So we have a little bit of peat, a little bit of um, firewood. I can make more um, firewood, I just have to chop more trees. I'm so glad guys, I'm so glad I didn't waste the time. And um, honestly, the materials to make the windows, because we actually got lucky guys. I was literally gonna make windows. Um, and I want to do something. I don't like that these two are reeds and these are all sedge. It, when you look back, it doesn't look like that nice, right? So I was thinking about pick, oh, I guess I have to move that. Is there anything in there? It's empty. Oh, actually, since it's empty, let's go put our gears in there. That's for our, um, our money when we go to see a trader, right? We have to have the money. Um, I was thinking I want to move these these baskets, right? Because I, I just don't like where they're placed. Um, see, I can switch it. So take this, put that there. I think that that looks a little bit cleaner looking. Um, kind of, oh, oh no, not crookedy, guys, not crooked. You know, cat, oh, cat doesn't like that. There we go, there we go. That looks a little bit better. Um, I'm hoping to get more sedge and put the two sedge there. And then these ones, maybe I could put another stack of those like over here. <laughs> Basically don't mix it because it drives me insane. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and pick this up, I guess, because we don't want that. We don't want to lose that, that's our chest. Um, so the stones, do we have one stones? Oh, I better eat guys, I better eat. Let's go outside and put, this is for our um, body soil guys. We need to be obviously panning this outside, right? So when we're sitting in the water here, I'll just put our dirt right here, you know, ready to go um, whenever. Um, Cause right now I need to get situated guys. Like I said, monsters are here now. I wanna make, um, you could see our tools are gone guys, right? So what do we need? We need another ax. We need another knife, right? So we're gonna put these tools. This is our backup tools, guys. I think I'm gonna do, cause we're gonna be hunting, right? So I think I could afford to do two more spears cause we do have, like I said, the, um, the hollow, right? So I wanna do, have four spears just for the beginning. So this one is gonna be a shovel, but we don't have a shovel, right? That's why I need to make some tools. So let's just go ahead and make a few tools, get um, prepared, because now we know monsters are here, guys. If monsters are here, I need to kill drifters to get us those gears, right? So we have to really, really fight, guys. We, ha we can't be scared. I mean, I'm not scared, but I'm just saying I have to fight. So, plus I need to hunt, guys. We have cooking pots now, so I can actually afford to um, get, I wanna get some fat, I wanna get some meat. I want to have some meals with the crock pot, but we don't have our um, crock pots yet, so I don't want to do any hunting until that clay forming is done. So I don't, I don't want our food to spoil, so that's why I'm saying I don't want to make any of, I don't want to hunt until I know that I have the tools or the, the clay products to do um, the crock pots. So don't want any food to be um, spoiled is what I'm trying to say. So we have spears, right? So one here, one here, and there's an extra one. We're gonna hang that. This one, this shovel is our backup. So we basically have one row of 
tools, right? So that leaves our inventory very, very minimum, guys. We only have little baskets. We don't have the hunter backpack, which will give us more inventory because we have to have skins and fat. So that's what I'm saying. I have to go hunting. Um, otherwise, we're never going to get... Um, we're never going to get more inventory because we don't have flax. We haven't started our production of flax yet, obviously, right? Okay, so we only have two tool racks. I don't think that that is enough. Um, we only started with two. Obviously, we just started the game, um, so that's understandable. But I want to have four um, because we need, like I said, we need the tool racks um, to store our um, stuff. I want to have one for each. You guys already know. We want to have spears and axes, shovels and knives. You already know. You know how I do. So let's just get our arsenal up and ready. Um, because like I said, drifters are here. Cat needs to be prepared. Our house is secure now, guys. We have a roof. We have all the four walls. We have a door. Um, we have windows. So we are protected, right? When we're inside, I also need to make more torches because, as you can see, there is no light in the house. So, at night, it will be bloody dark, right? So, Cat needs to put lighting in here um, just so we have light, guys. I don't want to be in the dark. I want us to be able to see when we're not in the house. This gives us light from the outside. Um, I will probably need one, I guess, um, to make more. Yeah, let's go ahead and just do that so I don't forget, guys. Because um, like I said, we do need torches. Not because of the house, but I, I'm going to have four in the house, but I need to have them outside when I'm going to... Um, what if we're trying to go caving? Yeah, Cat's going to need some torches. So I, I just want to be prepared, guys. I think 20 will be okay. 20 should be fine. And then I'm going to need more sticks because I'm still doing weapons. Let's go and put these torches here, guys. I want to I wanna get a little bit of um, torches, like I said. Let's go ahead and light this, guys, while I'm doing my tools. Okay. Okay, so we have some knives, right? So we're just setting up our stuff, guys. It doesn't it doesn't take long for torches. You can see that it it cooks very fast, so I have to keep an eye on it. Um, it doesn't take long for that. And I don't want to waste the peat, guys. Um, I need to harvest, definitely. When we harvest clay, guys, we're going to harvest the peat as well. Because I think the peat and the, the clay are by each other. So that's why I'm saying I need to have tools, guys. Because I'm going to be using shovels to get the peat and the clay, right? So I'm definitely going to have to waste a couple shovels. So that's why I'm saying I'm trying to be um, prepared, guys. Um, prepared for everything. So these are going to go here. And these guys, these go here, okay? Let's go check on this. See, they're almost done, guys. Um, I don't think I'm going to need any more. It's still going. Um, so, yeah, that's why I, I wanted to do that, guys. I knew that we needed our torches. Let's go ahead and put this one's going to go here. And we have to make sure, when we're playing the game, guys, as you guys know, always be um, refreshing your torches as they will um, burn out. Um, we don't have one here. So, boom, guys. We got four 
Um, so when we leave the house and, you know, it's not going to get dark, we can actually see. Um, oh, we need to put our limestone away. We don't want to use those. That's going to be, um, this is for dirt and clay. That's dirt and clay. That's like, whatever. Um, okay, do we not have one for stones? I thought we did. Let's just check. Oh, I, we have a lot of extra. That's right, guys. Yeah. Okay, so let's let's start one for just stone. Because um, we don't want to mix things, right? These are still good. I can turn this into jerky. I don't want to waste it, right? Because it's still food. And that's good for 23 days. See, I don't have to worry about the cranberries. Let's mix the cranberries together. Um, I had sedge, but I just used the sedge. Um, what can I put on me? 11 days. The mint is still good. I might, um, I got the mint because I didn't have food at the time. I can turn that into seeds um, if, if I need to. Or I could literally munch on them because they're, you know, they're cheap food source, whatever. They only do 35 sat, um, so it's not a lot. Um, I guess I'll eat those, get those out of the storage. Um, okay, I was still making more tools. Because we're not done with the tools, guys. We have a full set on us, right? But we have to fill up our rack. So we're just getting we're just getting prepared guys because like I said, when I use the, the the shovels that I have on me, guess what? I'm gonna need the shovels to be um, I'm gonna be taking more back basically. We need axes. We need everything guys, S especially for the first storm. I don't have any spears um, set up guys. Um, that's why I'm saying I have to be prepared. The storm will come. We haven't had a storm yet. So you have to keep that in mind as well. And I want to fight because we need the gears. We need the money. We need the um, ores that come with the storm. So, yeah, we have to be prepared. Plus, I need spears so I can do um, hunting. I might make a couple more tool racks to store um, some more spears outside. So we'll have spears in the inside, but I think spears on the outside as well. Um, so that way we can, f if we're outside fighting a storm, I can go ahead and grab, you know, more, um, more tools or whatever. Because that's gonna happen when you're when you're fighting a storm, you're outside, and you're like, oh, shoot, I don't have any more spears. At least you can go to the house and grab spears from the outside. So I like to be prepared. You guys know that. Um, so these are for the axes, guys. So let's step back. We need one more shovel. Um, we need one more shovel, two more spears, one more axe. Okay. And then we're good, right? That's all we need. Okay. Yeah, one more axe. Well, we're going to need, sorry, extra spears because we're going to put them outside. I have to make another tool rack. I hear chickens, guys, outside. I hear the little chickenies. Chicken means food, guys. Okay, so we did the axe and the shovel. Now I'm just doing the spears.
because we definitely will use these guys. We'll definitely use these. So it's a good thing that we found the translocators guys in the cave before the monster spawn. So honestly, I'm pretty content and very happy that we at least know where, um, and you know, we didn't just find the translocators. We found ruins as well. We got goodies. We got a little bit of treasure. Um, so that's great. It really helped us out for the, for the beginning game. You guys know that there is um, other ruins that I marked on the map to the, what was it, to the right over here, guys? Over here. We haven't been here, guys. There's one, two, three, four, five. So these five here on that water area. And then I believe I marked one over here, possibly. Um, I don't know if there's any more here this is the one that's by the house um but i'm not really like seeing any over here that is like popping up like giving me an indicator that it's a ruin um but again when you're up close you'll you'll know what a ruin is if you're in front of it some of the ruins you can clearly tell and some you really can't tell like something that might look like flowers is actually a ruin, so you don't know. That's why you need to, you know, run around the map and investigate, because you never know where the ruins are gonna be. And most of the time, um, yes, there's the surface ruins is what I'm talking about, but you know that there's plenty of ruins, guys, hidden in the caves, so you can't be scared. You have to go in the caves, investigate, and take a chance, and most of the time, you'll be lucky, like me, I'll find ruins and translocators, so you need to be a little bit brave and just, you know, try looking for them, and most of the time, you'll come out very lucky, very happy, um, if you take the time to, to look, if you're not, you know, too scared, whatever. I mean, I know that, I know going in a cave can be scary, um, especially early on, um, but that's why you're not supposed to, that's why you're supposed to do it before the monsters um, spawn that way you're not as um, scared so we're gonna make a couple more racks like I said um, to put these um, outside for more excess um, you know just accessible tools to grab and go just to be prepared because it doesn't hurt to be it doesn't hurt to have extra tools you know what I mean it doesn't, it never hurts. If anything, it's gonna come in handy, come in clutch. Um, so yeah. Okay, see, I'm totally out of um, sticks. So yeah, we need to punch more trees and stuff like that. Um, so we have a lot of grass. We can definitely do a little bit of our first pit comb, but we would have to have more sticks if we're trying to do the pit comb, because I don't have very many. I don't have very many guys. And that's not good. Okay, these guys, like I said, we're pretty stocked up. We have our whole um, arsenal right here full. And then I have, um, like I said, the four that are going to go here. Um, so we are ready for a storm. I'm not worried about that. trying to think what I need to do now. We probably need to um, probably need to go. Okay, guys. So we just made all of our tools. Um, let's see here. So yeah, we have a full rack. What we need to do now is collect the clay. Um, because we need to start our um, our pit kiln, right? Um, I'm going to need to set up the pit kiln outside. So let's go outside. Got a chicken running around um, outside. We have some chickens over there. And then the crops we have, I see some crops up there. Um, but we're not worried about that right now. Right now, that bloody sheep running all over. Oh my god. Oh my god. 
So I want to do a pit kiln. Um, there's so much grass there, right? Um, I'm thinking we can do like a pit kiln here. Just like, this is just temporary guys, right? Um, because we have to have it covered because it does, it looks like uh, rain is common in our area. So we don't want, um, if we're doing the pit kiln, we don't want our stuff getting wet, guys. And I have to remove some grass here. Okay, so we just do this, right, guys? We just don't want it to get wet, right? Okay, so this is just, like I said, um, temporary. Um, so this block is right here, I think, right? Let me just make sure. Yeah, I might need to get rid of a lot of this grass. Because we don't want anything catching on fire, guys. We don't want any wildfires in our in our area, obviously. Because the fire spreads all crazy. We would lose all the animals, all the trees. That would be bad. That would be very bad. Especially I don't want to lose the animals because I want to kill them. I want to eat them. So yeah. This music is bloody loud, guys. Yeah, turn that shit down. Music's pretty, but kind of loud. I love how these animals just like to be in, in my area. Like, get out of here. They always seem to be in the wrong place at the wrong time. They want to be like, just in your way and annoying. I might have to grab another knife here because we're using it. I need to get some dirt also. Okay. I need to get some dirt to kind of fill in um, a little bit uh, more of this water area. Or maybe I'll just take away from this section right here. That way we have a little bit of a walkway. Um, but because we're doing the pit kiln, I kind of want to extend this area right here. So yeah, we lost one of our um, knives, but that's okay. Those are, we do have those. So I'm extending that a little bit. That way you can kind of walk around, but now we have to extend this part as well. Oh, no more. Girl, get out of here. God, I told you guys, they're always in the bloody way. So annoying. They always seem to be in the wrong spot. I have to be careful. I hear bloody wolves. But I'm so glad, guys, with those windows. I think it looks so nice. Oh, my God. I mean, people, normal people don't have the windows for a long time, guys. Um, because we haven't even started the smelting, not to mention you have to have a pickaxe to even get those ores. So yeah, I'm like way ahead, especially having a bloody door. Um, that's great. So I think we have like what, three gears. I could technically get, um, a chest or another door, um, because we do have, um, front door, back door, side door. Um, I wouldn't mind having another door, honestly, to access the other side. Or I might just save it so I could buy a whole bunch of stuff at one time. I am considering that. 
See? I can hear the bloody wolf, guys. The bloody wolf. Okay, and this bloody chicken. <sighs> bloody chicken. Um, like I said, I might extend this little area because once I have this to go around, um, I want to be able to access the lake also. Yeah, you guys, this chicken better get out of here because this is going to be a pit comb. And yeah, the chicken can die. Um, I might want to move that <laughs> wooden bowl. That will, might be smart. Just set it over there. Um, might move the dirt as well, guys. Um, I don't want anything damaged by the fire, by the, the hot fire. It's just, it's not worth it, you know? We don't, we don't want to ruin or lose anything of our nice stuff that we worked too hard to get okay so we want to do the most that we can with the pit coat right so we'll start from the edges for the holes and then you go like this every other so that's why i did it in the the five so that way the first row is three and then the second row will be two and then three so i'm trying to get the most um from this pit coat so you go like that go like that go like that and like that so if you count that, you got three, six, seven, eight. So for a beginning pit kiln, this is fine, right? And it's covered, see? So nothing is going to get wet, guys. Even if it rains, I will be okay. Um, I did, like I said, I removed the grass all from here. Um, I did from, oh wait, guys, I just um, planted some, or I just placed some more dirt. But it's okay, because remember, um, I still have to make the the pottery, so it's going to take some time. So what I'll do now, um, before this um, knife wears out, we're just going to go ahead and clear out some grass, because you know I'm going to use this, right? You know I'm going to use it. So this will get used very well. Because we do, like I said, pit kilns are going to require grass. These bloody sheep stress me out. What time is it? Okay, so it's almost nighttime. Basically, this is the time that drifters would come out so I do have my knife up guys so you guys can see um, let's go I see some I see some berries that are ready and guess what they're ready to be clipped as well so we are gonna um, clip these and we're gonna go ahead not only clip them guys but we're gonna go ahead and multiply them So we're just going to go ahead and basically replant. Okay. So yeah, so we just went ahead and replanted those, those black ones. Um, where did we see those um, crops? Was it, was it on that side or was it this side? I think, I think it was up here. I can't, I can't remember guys. Was it up here? I'm just gonna get them. Yeah, I see some spelt. Wait, I couldn't get it. Oh, it didn't pick it up. There we go. Okay, so again, guys, I am a miner, so I don't get every... See, I lost that one. Um, I will get this one because that's a mature... Anyone that's... Anything that's mature, I will definitely get. 
But if something isn't ready, then I have a chance of, of basically losing it, right? Um, I'm going to get a little bit more dirt um, just for the future for building or whatever. Um, it's kind of better to do it, like I told you guys before in the past. It's better to start from the top so you don't ruin the bottom and that way you can still access the top. So I'm going to take dirt here from the top. But also, I <laughs> don't have any more um, packed dirt. We have 29 pieces, so we're just going to go ahead and now we have some more. Great. There we go. So we're just going to get some more because what we're going to do is just store it in our chest. We do have a chest for dirt. So that's fine. I do have my stack of but you got to remember, every time you go in caves, I am going to be using this pack dirt. So I have a stack now. doesn't mean I won't want any more in the future. It's better to have it now. That way I don't have to get it later. And I'm always making tools. I will use that. So we just lost a knife and a shovel. So oh, guys, is that a nasty drifter? We're going to kill him because we want to get we want to get gears. Did we not get anything, guys? Bloody fuck. Where did the other one go? Oh, here he is. Where are you going, buddy? See, I'm not even strong, guys. Why are they running? I grabbed the grass. But he didn't have anything either? How? They're supposed to. Oh, my God. See, I actually want to fight, guys. I actually want to get um, bloody gears. So I didn't get anything on the first two guys. That's actually weird. I have a drifter loot mod. Um, I'm surprised by that. I don't typically not get anything. He can't move fast because he's stuck in the water. Did he give me anything, guys? Oh! 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 Guys, we got to go in the house. <laughs> I did a bad thing. Um, I totally forgot. I don't have a bloody lantern. Uh, oh, I did get something, guys. Silver. Okay. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Hold on. Um, yeah, maybe we unload our shit first. Too excited there. Okay, so no more grass, guys. We're, we're okay on grass. I guess I need to collect sticks now is the next thing I should collect. Um, let's see here. Um, we'll do the weak one first. Um, that one is food. Um, yeah, speaking of food, let's eat. Good thing I picked up a little bit of berries outside because I'm eating all the mint. But that's fine. So we're going to go like that. And... Where is our dirt? So we got packed dirt. We'll put down there. This is low fertility. Um, so we have enough dirt, right? So we're going to do seven, because I burnt it out by accident. We're going to light it up. We're fine. We only lost the one. Um, we didn't lose, like, a whole stack. Otherwise, that would have been sad. Um, I hear a lot of drifters. Like I said, we don't have any gears. So I am okay and not scared um, to be fighting the nasty drifters. I would actually prefer that I'm trying to kill them, because, like I said, we need the stuff. We need, um, um, I don't have, this is supposed to be like for tree seeds, but we don't have tree stuff right now. Um, I'm going to try and just put this here, um, for now because we only have this and it, yeah, basically no space is what I'm trying to say. 
Do we have anything for gears? Or, I mean, ores. So that's empty, empty, empty. Okay, that one is fuel. Let's put this one. Oh, that one is powders. That one is stones. Okay, we'll put this one for um, stuff. So this goes here, right? We need a knife and a shovel. And then let's go fight. We need a knife and a shovel. Just so we're prepared for our inventory. Let's go ahead and eat. Um, I'm... Well, actually, I'm going to be throwing the spears, so... Um, where are they? They're right there. Look at them. Look at these nasties, guys. They can come in my house. It's fine. Because guess what? I'll kill them. Oh, guys! Guys, guys. This is a great episode. We just bloody... Watch, watch, watch. We just got a temporal gear. I'm going to save it inside of our bloody house. Look, guys. <gasps> Our first gear, episode four. Let's go. <gasps> guys, I'm so happy. So we're going to do it, guys. We're going to go like this. Right? And, or do we, or actually we put it in this hand, right? I can't remember, guys. Um. It might need to go in your in your hand because you're going to equip it, see, in your hand, and you're going to right-click, use it on the ground to set your, um, your spawn. So when we die, we're in our house. So if I die right now killing those drifters, I don't care. Let's go, guys. Are you guys ready? Do you guys want to see it? Um, like, cool, cool, the cool shot. Um, let's see here. We're going to go five. No, wait. Sorry. Don't be shy. Come on. We're going to go step back a little bit. And let's use our gear. One, two, three. Let's go. Is it not using it, guys? Is she not using it? Maybe it has to go in the torch hand. Hold on. I might have to switch it. See, I told you I wasn't sure. It might have to go there. Because it's the special hand. Um, let's, um, but then it says you're eating a current. Huh. Maybe we take that out and then put that there. You, you have to have a free hand, maybe? Or maybe I can't do it in that view. Darn, I was trying to be cute, guys. Um, let's go ahead and just set it in our house. Let's go right-click. One, two, three. Let's go. There we go. You can't do it in the other hand. Yay! <laughs> we did it, guys. Let's go. So that's why I told you I want to kill the drifters because I wanted the gears. Well, we got the first gear to set our spawn. Now um, I can actually delete that, right? Because that's not going to be my spawn now, right? This world, I mean, this is the world spawn, but I'm not going to spawn there um, anymore. I got my spawn i'm gonna bye bye let's go so now we got that let's go let's kill let's kill some drifties we don't need to sleep we need to kill all the because think about it we don't have a temporal storm right right so guess what if you don't have a temporal and i need to stay in my house because look i got more i got more spears let the nasties come guys what is the rift activity medium okay you know i'm not scared of no nasty Come in, nasty. The doors are open. The door is open. Ready for you to die. Wow. They never miss with their aim as far as the stones go. Um, if they're not going to come to me, I have to come to them. Yeah, they all want to go away. Guys, there's so many. There's so many. Yeah, 
Yeah, they're fighting each other. How dumb. Thing goes crazy, guys. Because when you run the fire, it's, it's kind, kind of, of like, like I'm already, already in a storm, in a storm, storm right, right, guys? Because I am technically um, fighting. It's like I am in a storm, but I'm not. This is actually nice. You just wait till nighttime, so technically, I can I can be getting. Um, I can be getting loot every night. I don't have to wait for a storm if I want my bloody, um, I want my gears. You guys know I'm not scared of no drifter. Guys, I'm getting flax. That's what I need. I need flax. I'm going to go in my house um, to unload. Let's go, guys. Look at this. I'm getting treasure, guys. I'm literally getting stuff. Bismuth. Okay, silver and bismuth. This I'm going to use. I can't break that, obviously. Um, I'm just going to be putting ores in a chest and organizing that later because right I can't do anything about it and I'm gonna die but it's okay because when I die I'll be full health right um I think I will cook the meat guys um it's almost gonna be yucky so I'm gonna put it over here right I'm gonna put this here and then grab a little bit of peat and just cook that while I'm killing drifters because it'll take some time to to cook, right? Because once I, once I die, I'll be full health, but this is just for the future so I can have food. Um, I need to put the flax away. I thought I had a... Yep. And I do have two. Um, pretty much, I need to fix everything, guys. Everything is horrible. Tattered, tattered. I mean, yeah, terrible. <laughs> terrible. Terrible. My mining hat. Everything's terrible. So there's one and one. Uh, but once we get our flax going, we'll be, we'll be fine. Um, I don't have any food. Um, I don't think I need the light now, guys. It's actually four in the morning. It's weird. It's four in the morning, but it's bright. It's definitely bright outside. We have some. We have some jerky. Um, this is still cooking. I'm gonna I'm gonna kill drifters because the nighttime is gonna go away soon. And if it does, then they go away, right? I don't, I don't have my thing on me, so I'll be fine. I can kill them. Oh shit! I, I didn't know another crawly was after me while I was killing one of them. Oh, really? My character is so bad, guys. Trying to get, trying to get my bloody, um, yeah, I'm about to die, guys, and I don't really care because then, remember, look, thank God, if I didn't, if I didn't, um, set my spawn, guys, I would have had to walk, 
I mean, not that it would have been hard, but... Where is that nasty? He's trying to get away because it's night, night, morning time. Where are you going? Oh, I'm going in my raspberry bushes. I didn't even notice, guys. Oh, he's getting poked too. <laughs> he died by the rasp. But I can't get a shit. I have to run through it. There's stuff. Oh my god, did I get... I didn't get anything. But usually when they die, you get something, right? He doesn't have bloody anything. There's a drifter in here. The little nasty crawly swimmer. Don't go away. I'm gonna kill you. Okay, he had a hide, guys. That's actually good. And he dropped... Oh, more bismuth, guys. Let's go in zinc. Let's go. We're getting stuff, so that's good. Yeah, I do have the spear. I have three spears. I can definitely um, hunt now, guys. Okay, take that out. That's done. Put this here. Close that. So that helps, guys. At night, I can fight. I don't have to waste um, the day or the time. Um, let's go ahead and refresh the torches. We do not want any of these burning out. Well, that was a productive um, night because we got stuff, guys. Um, we're just going to go ahead and put... I guess, whatever we get. If we get copper, obviously, it, it can go in another chest. Um, oh, the hide, guys, the hide. We need fat, guys. That's another reason why I kind of want to hunt, because without the fat, um, I can't have the oil lamp. Or, uh, oh, oh, see, see how this grass grew? Yeah. Cat needs to be careful, because I can't be... I added some dirt, and yeah. Um, I think I need to add a little bit more, more dirt. Ugh, that's gonna add more grass to the. I don't want to have any fires. We need to collect more sticks. Guys, I need food. <laughs> That's why I'm saying I might have to hunt. Um, well, I do have these berries. I might be okay. See, I don't really want to use this stuff, guys. So all I have is cranberries right now. Unless I... Um, I mean, I could make a meal here um, with the meat, but I cannot seal it, right? If I, use the, if I kill one of them, that will give me some meat for some time. So what we need to do is I want to get, um, there's peat here, and we need, like I said, clay, right? So I'd have to go all the way here for the nearest clay. I mean, is that the near? Oh, wait, we're here. There's clay here. There's clay here, but I said I needed peat as well. So I guess we'll just go along this coast and see what we find, um, yeah, and just see what we find. So I have a full, I have a full shovel here and a full shovel there. If I need more shovels, um, I guess I'll make more if needed, like I said. So we're going to go this way. Um, like I said, I'm going to get the clay. I believe it's not too far, right? Oh, there's berries here, guys. Thank God. And then I'll clip it, like I said, just because it's right here. And we'll quickly drop it on the ground. You know. We won't we won't waste time because what we're doing is we're making the berries increase. We're increasing our berries like very quickly. So I'm trying to go to the clay. 
Okay, so just go forward, I guess. And we can look at trees if there's any hollows, right? That that's not a hole. Um, I need I need the um, sticks because we're gonna do pit kill. Like I'm literally gonna do some clay forming, drop in our first set of um, pottery stuff, and then we'll have to end the episode here shortly because we're coming to that time where. You know, I want to keep our episode somewhat short, about an hour, not too long. That way I can give you guys a lot of content and just, you know, keep up and not get overburdened or whatever. So I like the cranberries because they last long, right? I'm going to go plant a whole bunch of um, cranberries at the house. I'm going to clip all of these cranberries. We're going to push them closer by the house because these are all cranberries. Yeah, they're all cranberries. This is, well, those are black currants. We have a tree seed. We will go, I guess, toward the home and plant it. Because we want, we, want, we want trees by us. Um, I don't want to travel too far for trees. Um, where's the black current? Because we have black current right here. Um, these are cranberries. So the house is here, right? We can plant a tree right here. Um, and we got these. These are all cranberries. I like the cranberries. See this, this little pond by the house. Um, we can we can put like um, I'm thinking reeds here because it's a baby it's a baby farm. We can definitely put reeds. Um, maybe we can start the the berry farm here, guys. I mean, might as well. I have to start it sometime, right? So I think I'll start it. I think we'll have it here, right by the lake. I think that I think that'll be good, right? Yeah, I'll start it here. So these are cranberries. Oh my god, my computer! Oh, oh! You see how it's it has a mind of its own? I didn't do that. It was moving by itself. The bloody. I even turned the touch screen off. Let me check because it's bloody pissing me off. I already turned that shit off. It's under personalization in your settings, and then you go to, um, oh no, it's not under that. It's under, where's, where's it under? Devices, touchpad, off. It is turned off. How the fuck is it moving? I have it turned off. I really don't understand. I have it turned off. It, it, it says, your PC has a precision touchpad. Okay, well, duh. Touchpad, off. Okay, well, why the fuck are you going crazy when I touch it? It's so bloody weird, guys. Um, anyways. Yeah, so we'll put the berry farm here. I kind of wish I didn't put the other black currants where I put them. But it's okay. I was trying to increase our stuff. Um, but now... I want to put it here. So I want to do eight. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, eight. Okay, we have a lot of berries. Um, if we're going to go get those clay, I don't want to have all of this, um, how you call it, the inventory. Oh, we need to do the weird traps, guys. There's rabbits and shit around. Look, see, that rabbit, I could have killed it if it if I had a trap. Okay, what are these guys? What are these? <gasps> these are red currants. Let's go ahead and clip all these and we're going to bring it over to our thing that we're starting already. Because these are all um, flowering and they're... Oh, those are the nasty raspberries. Uh, I mean, I'm going to grab those as well. Okay, so we have eight of these. Let's go ahead and put that, guys. That's perfect. That's perfect. Perfect. 
right? Because we're trying to we're trying to do that, right? So those are cranberries. I'm gonna have another set that's not you know that do doesn't you know, because remember we have a have, have to have a gap. Um, so one more thing can go there. Maybe blueberries. Um, a gap here. We can. Uh, I'm gonna leave another gap here just in case I have a different type of berry. Oh, we have the gooseberries and um, those other woven berries. Those ones might, I didn't see the woven berries, they didn't stack. So let's give it a couple rows. So there's one here, skip, one here, skip, one here. Let's start the, I wanna start the, berries this way I'm just I, like I said I'm trying to spread them out Looks so weird when they don't like that one. Just I think I'll break it if I do that. Yeah, it it'll get fixed <laughs> once it goes back to normal. Yeah, so I need to go. I need to go back in the house, like I said, to unload. I have too many stuff on me. But I'm still going to need some berries on me. Okay, so we have a lot there. Um, I might keep that on me because, yeah, I, I still need something. Um, I just need shovels. We're gonna get, we're gonna get clay. Um, that's cordage, right? So if you do, it only. I guess I could have five traps. I, I guess, and we'll save the rest of that. Um, but you have to sacrifice sticks. That's a problem. But we just need five, just five. But I want to, I want to get, I want, I want us to get food, guys. This is, this is the simple way for me to get food, right? Because we're putting up traps, right? So we'll put one like here in front of the house, and then we'll put one out here because see there's a rabbit there right and he's gonna want it he's gonna want this food um, because there's a trap and if those sheep fall into it that's their fault um, I'm gonna have to because you know my ass is gonna probably fall into my own trap I always do especially if I don't remember where they are that's why all this grass needs to go, guys. If if I see the trap, then I can avoid it. If I don't see it with because of the grass, then that's when I fall into it. Right? So there's there, right? And then I want to put one up here by the house. I shouldn't be walking along this way, probably. Not too much. So this is just if these nosy animals are around and they just happen to be here in the wrong place the wrong time um, and then I want to put one over here if they try to I don't know just be nosy and if that guy goes to it that's his fault if he dies 
Yeah, look, look at him smelling that shit. If he, yeah. Okay, whatever. Okay, so I feel better. Now I put traps. Let's go get... Let's go get some clay. We got to get get going here. Not go, No goofing around. I mean, I want to do more of the berry farm, but it's not necessary at this second. Oh, guys, there's a hollow. Guys, guys. Let's go. Let's bloody go. Guys, I'm bloody hollow. We have to take, I always take out the leaves so I know that this is a hollow. So nothing distracting or um, confusing me. This is great, guys. If we didn't have a chest, I would have been happy because this is a hollow. Um, I want to get rid of these flowers. I want to get rid of anything distracting. I want to be able to see my bloody hollow. But I need the sticks too. Plus, if I pick this up, I can drop it on the ground and then it despawns. You know what I mean? Or if I break it and don't touch it, it will despawn. I can't stand these things. They're way too bushy. I usually break those things. Can't stand them. So we're going to pull out a hollow because we obviously have... We're going to leave the hollow there, but we're going to put the, the treasure inside. Inside of my hollow. Just cleaning up the area a little bit. It's very messy here, guys. So bushy, guys. So bloody bushy. We need to definitely um, get more reeds, guys, because we need to make those fishing baskets. That's going to be for the line as well. Just kind of make sure this is not a hollow too. Because, you know, I'd be getting too many hollows with one stump. You already saw that I got, this is the third one. That's a hollow. Well, all of my hollows are one stumps. So I had to check this. <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't have been surprised. It's not, but it could have been, right? I see a cave, so that's why I want to uh, mark it. But I'm just, like I said, I'm getting sticks right now because I know I'm going to be doing getting clay to do pottery. These I'm going to clip also because those bunch berries are going to be in our, um, that's going to be in our berry farm. Oh, there's more sedge, guys. I need more sedge also. Too distracted by this damn game. I can't even do what I'm supposed to do, guys. 
Yep, it's a bloody cave, guys. We gotta mark it. It's a bloody cave. Oops, 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 guys. Um, I don't want to go in that right now, but like I said, I wanted to mark it. I'm trying to get sticks right now. We're going to use it for the pet cone. I have the grass. Remember, we have plenty of grass. I got all the grass around the house area, so that gave us a lot of, um, gave us a lot of grass, basically. Um, oh, oh, guys, guys there's, there's another, another bloody, bloody hollow. hollow. Let's, Let's fucking go. What about this one? No, it's just a log. Bloody fuck, guys. Okay, this I'm dumping. This I'm dumping. I might keep that just for if we get bees. Um, since I already picked it up. That I'll plant. We don't have food, but I also need two more sedge baskets, so I'll probably get this. Yeah, let me get all the sedge, guys. Because if I don't make the baskets with it, it's definitely good for food, obviously. So that's already two hollows on this world already. I'm just cleaning up our area, making our world a lot prettier. More visible, but we're also getting all of the sticks. I almost have a stack of sticks, so that's honestly great. Um, I just gotta make sure this is not a hollow. It looks like it's just a log, but you can't be can't be too um, sure. You have to check. Drifter, so they're probably in that cave below. Um, but we need to get that hollow, the one that that I... Okay, so look, that's 24. That's exactly a bloody basket. Um, we already marked that as a cave, right? And I might just get this, guys, um, because it's it's wood. And I want to make sure I don't think it's a, um, a hollow. <laughs> So if I get it, then I know it's not a hollow. You know what I mean? Or I could save it, honestly, guys, for, for lime. I, li I literally could do that. So was this one the hollow or was this one? This is the hollow. I'm going to grab this one since I'm already doing the damn wood. And I picked up something. What did I pick up? Probably a flower. Okay. I thought about getting those, but I don't need it right now. This one's not a hollow. So yeah, so we're gonna grab that hollow here in a sec. We're, we're gonna... Oh! I got a seed. Okay. I'm definitely gonna plant that. Um... My inventory's full. I told you I was going to pull up my, my basket. Right? Or the chest. We're going to um, save those. I mean, I'll probably plant these, but I'm just putting it in there for now. Or I might open that, right? Because I'm going to go like this. 
and we're gonna we're gonna take whatever is in there. Hopefully not just that, right? Oh my gosh, yes, let's go sunflowers. I love the sunflowers in this game. They're so pretty. Flax, yes. Empty, that's fine. Okay, and remember, we're not taking that. We're keeping the hollow there because that's right by the house. Um, I'm going to mark it because we have to do that. We have to know where they are. I don't want to go crazy trying to look for them. So our house is here. We have one there. We have the other two here. So it is pretty convenient. The other one will be right there. Awesome. I didn't even get my bloody clay yet. Ridiculous. I told you this game, when you want to do something, you're distracted because you're seeing a whole bunch of other shit that distracts you. And look, there's... Oh, that scared me, guys. I thought that that was a... I thought that that was... Oh, well, I guess it's good we came here. The clay's right there, guys. Um, honestly, guys, look, there's copper, and I'm going to grab the flax, hopefully. Okay, I got two of them, but guys, there's bloody copper here. Let's go. I'm going to move a little bit this way. Um, we're going to do copper. This is a great find. It sucks that there's, um water around i don't like that i'm gonna get all of this bushy stuff away to get the trees to get the sticks i mean and oak or maple seeds whatever if there anything falls Anything that fell, we're gonna make sure we can pick it up, right? Okay, so we have our sticks. We got, I'll open up the thing, right? Because we're gonna have, we have maple seeds already and flax in there, right? So we don't, and we're gonna put the whole thing of sticks. We'll keep this on me, because I'm gonna get more sticks, obviously. We're gonna go like this, guys. I'll probably chop that, but I'm gonna keep that there. Can we do that? Can I chop that? Yeah, and not break this. So, what do we get? Oh my god, guys, yes! Let's bloody go pumpkin, cassava. We'll take the cassava, empty. Okay, no problem, right? No problem. And we're going to put the one maple log. Um, I'm going to pick that up. Oops. Oh, no. Actually, I might keep it here. We're going to grab clay. We're going to be putting the clay in there. We're going to be putting the clay in there. Let's go get clay. Oh, I have to mark. Oh, there's another... Oh, if I do that, I might break that. I don't want to break it. Let's just put our um, hollow. This is so awesome, guys. We have five now that cat's not touching. It's only there to... Um, oh, oh, we have some berries. Um, I want to get this for food, guys. There's a whole bunch. I want to go. I want to go around because I don't want to get um, poked. Okay, I think I got. I got twenty. That's good. There's a piglet there. Um, I do have black currants. Oh, 
Oh, is that a cave? Is that a cave, guys? Okay, hold on. We might have to mark that. I'm looking around because you never know. There could be... Um, so a lot of clay. I'm looking for, you know, fruit trees. and <gasps> Guys, Terra Preta. Not kidding. Um, yeah, we already had five locations. Mm, now that's that would be six. Uh, I'm kind of wondering if I should go there and get it now because I know the clay is here, right? I feel like if I don't get it now, I'll forget. So I think I'll go there really quick before it turns, um, you know, dark. Because I can get that clay and then head home, no problem, right? I just don't want to um, forget that I have... If I do the clay, I might forget about the Terra Preta. Fuck, guys. All this um, Terra Preta. Ridiculous. Our farm is going to be great, guys. Our farm is going to be great. Okay, there... Seems to be more. Please tell me it's fire clay. I can't tell. It's kind of dark. It's probably blue clay. Ugh. Guys, it's still blue clay. I was hoping for red clay. Oh, I already marked. Oh, guys, I'm all thinking I found new Terra Preta. This is where we started. I deleted the. Remember the world spawn? See, this is um, blue clay as well because I marked it right here. But I'm gonna put another marker. Um, it, so me thinking I found another um, Terra Preta, it isn't. But I got excited. I didn't realize I went to our first location. Okay, my bad. Whatever. But you know what? So I don't have to like run all the way down here. Um, I think I'm just gonna get it. Cause remember we were gonna get clay. Um, I'm just going to grab, this is my Terra Preta, right? I'm going to get it. And let's put a light. I don't want you guys to be in the dark. Um, this episode is running late. We might have to start our clay next episode, which is fine. Like I said, I'm not in a rush for this world. Monsters are already here. Um, so there's nothing to worry about. You know what I mean? Monsters are already here. That's medium. Um, medium. This is Terra Preta. This is Terra Preta. Yeah, monsters are here. So honestly, there's no rush now like there was in the beginning. Can you go away? I, like I said, every time I want to do something, there seems to be animals where I need to do my crap. It's like they know where you're going to work and they just want to be there to annoy you. I mean, I almost want to kill her. Kinda. Okay, medium, medium, medium. Yeah, I think that was it, guys. But you have to check. Well, you can see on the side, I guess. I almost want to kill her because if she runs, she's going to go to the water. And I could make literally a meal from her. But it's dark. I don't want to deal with that right now. Okay. So, oh, the bloody water, guys. The fucking bloody water. Maybe Cat just needs to be careful. And like go around. Yeah, because if I go around, I already have these raspberries, so I'm gonna grab these because I saw more. Okay. Oh, you can see, you can see our house, guys. See? See how you light it up? It really helps. You can see your home. Um, yeah, I'd have to go all the way around this way. If I don't want to go in the water. Okay, so I want to get some clay, right? We don't want to forget our chest. Um, it's where the hollow is. I could just grab the clay now. 
And then when we get to the house, we will save the game, unload everything. But we'll definitely do our clay on the next episode. Let me get enough of this. I can do three stacks, right? And I'll easily use that for our first beginning um, stuff. Because we need a vessel. We need... Um, if we're going to start our farm, I definitely want to do a watering can and bowls and crocs. The tool molds, not worried about that right now. I'm worried about getting set up first. But definitely going to need at least three stacks because it takes almost a whole stack just for a vessel. It's like 40 pieces. So yeah, let's do three stacks. I can always come back to get more. We might even have some animals that fell into our traps like rabbits. Maybe the sheep. I don't know. But it takes more than one, uh, one hit from that trap to kill them. I think so they'd have to multiple times like fall into the trap so that's why I have to check them all the time so when they mess up then I reset it up again then they accidentally fall in back into it I only had two sedge so I'm thinking I might eat it and honestly I was thinking I might just get another um because why not I'm going to use it not only for the stuff the basic stuff but remember I'm going to have to make tool molds and we need to really find fire clay but I know when I'm not looking I'll find it I'll just be exploring the map and I'm not worried I know we'll find it it's not a big rush like I don't have to make pies it's just something cool to do for the game so like I said, not worried. Did we already do four? We did, guys. Okay, let's go back to our hollow. Our hollow's right here, right? With our chest. So actually, we have extra space, right? If we put the clay in. Because I'm going to plant these outside. And that could go in there. Okay, so we'll pick... Oh, 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 it's my torch, isn't it? Oh, my God. We'll do this so we can see. There we go. I guess we'll put these here because we're gonna I want to plant these at the house we already marked the hollows right yep these two and I don't have to go in the water to go home no wait wasn't there like a cave here where the clay was and I didn't mark remember I told you I said there might be a cave was that right here guys or am I tripping Oh, I'm not tripping. There is a cave. I just didn't want to, like I said, I didn't want to forget. So there is a cave. Oh! With more copper, guys. More copper. Look at that, guys. Inside of the thing. I'm almost tempted. Should we just pick up the nuggets, guys? I mean, I'm definitely going to mark it, obviously. Um, I'll just put right here, copper. I think I should get it because we need the copper to do tools. Um, I'll just put like, after I collect it, I'll put, I'll put a marker like right here to know that that tells me that I need to, um, I'll get the copper right by the hollow as well. 
I just want to peek. Or maybe we shouldn't. Maybe we shouldn't. It's dark. Um, we can't get up. <laughs> yeah. There was... Right, there was copper. This is where we got the clay, right? Yeah. Where was the... The hollow was over here. Right? Wait, that's not... I'm just breaking it. So the hollow was over here. Yeah, next to the bushes. Yeah. So yeah, I wanted to come here because there was copper here. Oh, it's in the bloody water. I was going to put a little marker there so I know that there's copper there. Because I feel like we need the nuggets. So we got clay. We didn't get the peat. Um, that's not a big deal. That the peat is by the um, the ruin. There's some peat there. <gasps> There's drifters, guys. Let's go home. Um, I didn't want to go in the in the water. Like I said, I didn't want to go in the water to mess up. Um, that's not a. That's the cave that we marked. Okay, let's stay up here. And this is the other hollow that we found. Wow, it's crazy. We were just going to find the... I thought that was crops. Um, we were just going to find the, um, the clay, and then we ended up... All these... We found the two hollows. That's crazy. Oh, I need to end the episode, guys, but, um, yeah, it's been a great episode. A lot of great finds, guys. A lot of great stuff. Copper, hollows. We got, oh, see? Um, people are messing up our traps, but it's probably the sheep. Like, they're not dying, but see, look, people are actually, oh, the chicken just died. I just heard it. Squawk. I, I was going to plant the oak. Because we're going to need that. Let me come back to the chicken. So I can um, plant the trees. See look. Everybody's falling into our traps. Somebody is. I don't know if it's the drifters. Uh oh. Did I kill the sheep? Oh fuck. Oh, 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 God, guys. Um, now I have to, I guess. Oh, now his wife is coming after me. Oh, and I fell into my trap. Oh, my gosh. Oh, shit, guys, my computer is acting crazy. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Um, I guess I might as well have this my... Um, do I have ladders? Yeah, I do. Oh, my God. My thing is acting crazy. Oh, my God. I'd be messing up all my shit. But I want to kill them. I can't go in the water, though. Oh, shit, what the fuck? He'd be trying to ram me, guys.
Okay, I need to kill him, guys. That's um meat. Meat. I gotta be careful. There's wolves around here, guys. I think one of my spears were at the house. Um, I didn't, I chased him here. I didn't throw any here. Um, I think I left one on the floor over here, guys. Um, it wasn't my good one. Um, I can't tell is that one dead or the other one. Maybe they're sleeping. I don't know. I need to go home and unload. Oh my god, look at him run around all psycho. The way he ran was all crazy. Where are you gonna go? Oh, I guess I have all four of my spears. For some reason, you know how the game, like... I don't know. The game, like, tweaks out and you... It goes in the wrong spot. crazy but yeah like i said i want to fight because it has the the drifters are here let me put away stuff oh wait i have meat but i have fat now i can do an oil lamp or don't i need a fat for the um the simple minor thing we'll have to take a look at that I can't remember I'll have to look at that cuz see I have one two I'm missing a, a, a thing guys I thought I had four on me I told you sometimes this game is weird like, you lift up something. Um, maybe it's outside. Okay, so I don't need... Um, I need to see where my, um, I, sh I should have, like, four spears. Look at this psycho. Um. Did I throw a spear? Remember? Okay, that's from a drifter. I couldn't pick it up because I was full. These guys are not dead. The drifter fell into that. Um, I was supposed to have a spear. <gasps> so I put it up and not only did it kill a chicken, it killed a rabbit. I told you these um, snare traps are awesome. Okay, let me grab the rabbit before it just spawns. I don't know where my spear went, guys. It didn't break. I'd rather have the meat than the bone. <laughs> um, I just gotta. I'll go put it in the house. Maybe I could pick up more stuff. Um, fuel. Yeah, 
I don't know where my spear went, you guys. I thought it was in the house. Remember, at one time I had all four. Well, I, I have to have four, so I need to dump these um, tree seeds because they're in my inventory wasting space. I, grass I guess I'll grab the bone. Um, I'll do the oak tree close by the house. Um, the maple trees will put out, spread them out. I want to kill those, um, I want to kill those sheep. I mean, I don't need to, I guess. I guess I'll get them later because I haven't even done Look at the rab look at the rabbits. They're nosy, right? They're they're smelling the see how I told you I put the traps? Because they're falling into these traps. They want the food. Look, the other one already fell for it. And then guess what? I got another a fooders. And then this one, they didn't fall for it, but they they did uh, mess it up. And oh the, the rabbit did mess up that one. See, I'm getting rabbits. I'm definitely getting the rabbits. And the chicken, apparently. The rabbits are nosy. I need more fat, but I'm only going to get that. Oh, see, he's mad. He is mad, guys. I have to kill him now because he's angry at me because of the, um, the trap. He's mad. A lot of meat. Not a lot of fat, but definitely meat. Look at that. I literally just put that trap and I got another rabbit. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What happened? This game is like literally glitching. Uh oh, he's gonna he's gonna fall for the trap and then get mad. I'm gonna go on my pedestal. Power tower. Watch, she's gonna do that and mess up. Look, see, guys? See? I know what I'm talking about. She's bloody mad. She's bloody mad. Even though it's her fault. It's her fault, guys. Yeah, good night. Your husband's probably going to come over here in a sec. Too bad I didn't have crocs, guys. Might just have a lot of meat. Oh, the other chicken came over here. Guys, guys. I told you these snare traps are life. You guys have to have the primitive survival mod and definitely do the snare traps, fishing baskets. Oh my god. And obviously because the hollows. Yeah. You guys need to... Okay, this guy, he's going to be mad. I'm going to get in my house. Shut the fucking door. I got a lot of food, guys. I got chicken and I got... Uh, I got chicken and I got that. Okay, I got three fat. 
Definitely gonna save one for an oil lamp. Um, I might start the hunter backpack um, right now. Uh, hold on. I don't wanna waste the big hides. I might start maybe the medium hides. That's a medium hide and you just need reeds. Okay. We'll do medium hides. Because I don't want to use the large. That's for... Um... Oh no, wait. Why am I doing that? <laughs> um, I can only do two. Because I'm doing... Not... Yeah, not, not that, that yet. That's, that's later. I have to collect more reeds. I need to do the fat. So I'm saving one fat for the, um, the oil lamp. So that's going to go there to cure. So we're going to eventually... Um, I don't want the brains. Uh, I don't want the brains. Um, they can turn to rot. So we're going to empty our inventory, guys. Um, I don't have any sticks on me. Oh, actually, I probably don't want to mix the dirt with the clay. I probably want the clay by itself, guys. Yeah. Where's the wood? Okay. This is just for tanning. Um... We're going to set this down. Um, I'm going to move these. Because I'm going to put sedge there. We're just going to put these um, over here on this side. Yeah, it's fine. Put the sedge over here. Keep all the sedge together. Yeah. So we have four stacks of clay. We're going to use the clay on the next episode to do our pit kiln and we'll be good to go. There we go. So we have four different types of dirt there, guys. Oh, we have flowers. This is supposed to be for reeds I don't, and then flax. I don't want to mix it. That's going to be ores. There's nothing there. We can just plant flowers. If I have to, I can mix other things with that. That's empty. So we did a little bit of hunting, guys. A little bit of hunting. Um, how long is the meat good for? Okay, the meat is good for nine days. That should be enough time um, 
that should be enough time to um, make the pit kiln. Or we made the pit kiln. Um, fire, you know, do some clay molds the next time we get on, and then fire it. It should be done like what the next day. It should be fine. Um, and I do have four spears still. Oh, look, guys, everybody's ruining our shit. Look at that. Oh, God, guys. I, I almost literally could have died, and he's going to touch that. Yeah. He's mad. I hate it when they mess up my trail. But see, it's working, guys. It's definitely working. My trap is working. People are dumb. Or the animals are dumb and falling for it. I've been getting chickens. I'm getting rabbits. Fall for it. And see that rabbit just fell for it. He died. And he's gonna die. Oh, he ran. He knows better. He knows better. They're all scared. He saw me pull out the spear and he said, oh, hell no. He, he ran. He's smart. Not that smart, though. But he's already damaged, so, yeah. Oh, shit. Really? Fuck me. The other one went all the way. Over here. I'm going to let him calm down. So he thinks I'm not going to get him. I'm going to go on the other side and trick him. You know how I do. I be sneaky, guys. He thinks that I'm not going to go after him. And when he puts his guard down, that's when he gets killed. Good night. See, cat got him. What is that called, guys? Oh, yeah, that's right. Savage cat. Savage cat. Come up from the top. Come up from behind. Boom. Good night. That's how we do it, guys. That's how you do it. Savage cat in action. That's how we do it, guys. Is that a mom or a baby? Babies don't really have meat, so there's no point in killing them. Yeah, we need to save the bloody game, guys. I want to play, you know, like I'm so used to doing the lives where I play for like, you know, hours and hours. But then like to know that I have to limit myself, it's just so hard because I'm so used to playing longer. <laughs> So I think the power tower here is fine for the home. Let's go let's go make some more power towers. We know we're going to do more hunting and killing. We'll put one we'll put one here. Right? Um we want to make power towers everywhere. Um cuz we never know where we're, where we're going to be at that time. And like I said, they do come in handy apparently. Cats using them all the bloody time. So these are truly the power towers. Um, I need to make more, um, how do you call it? More ladders. I didn't have enough sticks. one more okay that's enough i already used a lot of sticks we need to save the sticks for pitco 
I mean, we only have six, is it six slots? Three, three, six, seven. Oh, we have eight, eight slots. Um, so yeah, I might even have to get more sticks. But our meat guys, next time we come on, No room. I guess the berries will be fine on me for now. So when this cures, guys, we're going to need to, like I said, um, we're going to still need, um, obviously, reeds, right? You, you need reeds. Oh, yeah, that chicken still had feathers. My inventory was full. Oh, my God. Oh, a rabbit came. Wow. Guys, every time... I told you, every time I reset the trap, I turn around, there's another bloody animal dead. <laughs> it's awesome, but it's crazy. That's what I'm trying to say. So yeah, trust me. You guys need to do this um, snare trap. If you want... Especially when you're first starting, you don't have any bloody food. <laughs> it's going to definitely help you. Like, I'm getting red meat like crazy. And I obviously put him in good spots. Look! This other rabbit, too. My God. These bloody rabbits. They're not smart, guys. Ugh, I'm constantly getting meat and hides, though. I'm, I'm happy. I need the meat. Not, not complaining about the meat. And this bloody grass. It needs to get out of the way. Like, because I can't see the traps with the grass. Plus, you know, I don't like the grass. But I'm definitely obviously going to use it for the pit comb as well. And now I need to get another knife. Because I'm harvesting now. I'm actually killing. Um, so my knife is losing its um, durability. But I'm definitely done. No more. No more hunting. Um, I think I did a lot of, I got a lot of food, or meat. So I can definitely do the crock pots later when I get the thing. And then, um, I will, um, yeah, so the next episode we'll do the clay forming. We will, um, we'll do the clay forming and then we'll do our cooking, our first meals together. So that will be fun, right, guys? That will be fun. I'm going to go over here and sit on my bloody bed. Now we got bloody, um, we have, um, how you call it? We have windows, right? That's bloody awesome. Guys. Thank you so much for watching my episode, episode number four of our Vintage Story series. Please be sure to like the video and turn on your notification so you guys know when I do upload my next video or announcements. Until next time, guys. Bye.